Fairy Tale 3, 20, so many cliff hangers. My gosh, hero. Okay, Arcadios confronts the princess. There's still issues to be dealt with as far as uh, Team Natsu. We're gonna, they're going to lose their magic, get captured. We, we, this is going to happen. Uh, Rogue and Fro reunited, but there's still the whole thing. Gigel and the shadow and and what are the side effects of him consuming the shadow? Is he going to get possessed or something? So all that, all that, and more. And Team Jalil is, is standing there basically as the the, uh, the cavalry, right, you know, to come in. So, wow. Okay. And then we go, as if things weren't enough, right, we have Minerva and Urza. And people really want to see Minerva get put down. Okay, and let's okay, let, let, let's just go ahead and get to this. So here it is. Urza knocked down. We know she she's not going to lose. Okay, she's not going to lose. All right, but there's Kagra. It looks like she's shivering. Okay, she's been run through by Minerva. Then there, there's Miliana. Okay, who's crying. Okay, and she's got these huge, she was tortured by Minerva. Whip marks all over her back. And Minerva's like, I'm going to publicly execute Titana, Urza. You know, one character, Fairy Tale gets so much criticism, right? And uh, and there was a time when uh, Naruto got massive criticism too, all right? And and, and it's maybe for some different reasons. But one character that Fairy Tale, even people that don't like the series, don't care for it, one character that comes out is Urza. There is no way that Urza's gonna die. It's just there's, it's fan protection at this point. There's simply no way. If Urza got eliminated out of Fairy Tale, I'm not saying everybody would leave it, but the enjoyment factor would be cut at least 50 percent, and some people would leave. I absolutely believe that some people just just say goodbye. You know, I I no, and you know until they brought her back or something. I mean, there's yeah. Yeah. So anyway, uh, yeah, too popular a character. But anyway, the whole thing with Juvia and Gray and Leon, uh, it was okay because it was short. I just don't the, the whole drama and con con competition between the two. I couldn't care less. Although I did like the whole shotgun ice with water. I mean, it does Gray and, and Juvia's do go well. I mean, water, ice, so it you know, so it, that does kind of go well. Anyway. Juro, okay, wow, 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 and Laxus, wow, okay, yeah, and Lightning God Slayer pretty much went down the way everybody thought, uh, some people may think that this was kind of, um, may have been kind of uh, not good because it was too short, let's just admit it, okay, get this guy out, well these three, the sooner that this guy is knocked the heck out, which is what happened, okay, the better it is for us fans, because th this guy isn't anywhere near, he hasn't shown anything, anywhere, these two guys are just too much, okay, so that him getting, him getting, you know, put down was, was uh, really a good thing for us fans, so we don't, okay, he's out of the way, the trash has been taken out, and uh, we can actually get to the real fight, so, yeah. Yeah, that was, that was, yeah, 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 and, and they're building him up even more. They're like, look, this guy is the most powerful human there is, okay, he's he's now number five, what was he, number eight, or eight of the Saint Wizards, and now he's five, and they're like, well, the other four are gods, so, go figure that, yeah, okay, yeah, I, y yes, okay, and the, <laughs> the whole Lax's fan group over there is pretty funny. But anyway, I won't get too much into that. Um, this this is going to be, next chapter is going to be crazy. But there are just so many. And, and this is this is it. We're just two gladiators, Laxus. All right, Jiro, your eyes speak volumes. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's going to be. And, he, and see, Laxus has a lot to prove. Okay. He's got a lot to prove. All right, and Juro is just powerful. Now, 
what do I? Th who do I think is going to win? I'm going to go back to the whole thing. If we keep getting closer to the event, and uh, I keep waiting for some big, big battle or battles to get uh, not decided because of that event, and that may actually be what happens. Maybe the the, the catastrophic catastrophic event happens, and we simply don't get closure in all this. But this. With these two and their abilities, this is going to be pretty phenomenal just to watch, as regardless of how far it goes through. Because they're just, they're just two, they're bosses. These are two bosses clashing right here. This is going to be something. And the whole thing, now you, you kind of, if I had to predict, I would say actually say Laxus because they've built back Juro so high. Okay, you can kind of, I mean, Hero is really telegraphing this stuff out. He's really showing it pretty big. He's got him so high. In, in comparison to Laxus, right, now he's the underdog. And then, you know, the underdog wins. It's a story we, that we as fans want to see. So that looks like what's going to happen. Uh, I really enjoyed it. I enjoyed, actually, the whole idea of us having all these different slices, different things to look at. Uh, this is something I've mentioned a lot in Naruto. I really enjoy this, the way it was set up. Okay, uh, this was a great chapter to me even though there wasn't anything singular okay it carried everything on it still it gave us updates is really what happened on this whole thing and even though the whole thing with Minerva was small and and, and the battle Juro and Laxus it was enough it was enough to just for, for us to want more you know just to give us a taste just so we want a lot more of it so I'm loving it I like the way Hero's doing this and he's only gotten better, even though he had a rough start with the series, in my opinion. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and end this. I'm, I'm really, really enjoying this, and then as soon as I'm done with this, I'm going to read it again. Anybody can be an anime fan. Anybody can be a fairy tale fan. You can always subscribe. You can always unsubscribe. You can do anything you want to. Until next time, take care.